Today I'd like to talk about how to fix the problem if you're having trouble with drag and drop in your VirtualBox client. And also I'll demonstrate the copy and paste getting that turned on. So I just created this new clone of my blank Windows 10 client. And so we'll go ahead and start that up, which I just did, and I've got it on the wrong screen there. Okay. So it's starting. So while it's starting, you can see, we'll take a look at a couple of things. All right, so, so right here you see under Devices, we've got Shared Folders. We've got Shared Clipboard. Okay, so we can um, share our uh, copy and paste feature functions bi-directionally if we want, and we can drag and drop bi-directionally. But before we get started with that, let's just go on and verify that that is not turned on right now. Okay, so I've got <clears throat> this picture that I took, and we'll go ahead and try to drag it over to, let's just try to drag it into Documents. All right, so I can't drag that over. All right, so that's not working. Um, and I can't copy and paste because it isn't working. So if I take the drag and drop and I turn it on bi-directionally, you would think that you would be able to now come over here and drag and drop. Or if I turn the copy and paste on, you would think that I'd be able to copy and paste, okay? But I can't. So the problem is if uh, we don't have a certain feature installed called Guest Additions. So what you need to do is choose Insert Guest Additions CD Image under Devices. And what that will do is install the virtual guest edition CD in your virtual CD drive. Okay, so let's go to this PC and your CD drive and under VBox Windows Editions there's an application, just double click that and go ahead and install that. So it comes by default with uh, virtual box, you should be able to install it from the devices drop-down. Alright, we're gonna have to reboot our instance of Windows 10. So I'm running Windows 10 in virtual box inside Ubuntu 22. Alright, and it's restarting. So you can see at this time, we can we still cannot drag and drop. Let's go ahead and demonstrate that. So I can't drag and drop. Okay. So if I go to devices now, I should be able to enable drag and drop. Okay. Oh, I have that enabled. Well, you have to give it a minute after you reboot the first time after you've used, after you've installed the guest editions before it will work. So let's just give that a second. Okay, so it should be working now. Now it's working. Okay, so it is working and let's see if we can bring that over into another folder. Let's see if it'll go the other way. So this is working bi-directionally. We can drag our picture bi-directionally. So let's see if we can enable uh, clipboard. Okay, we already have that turned on. Alright, so let's see if I can copy that picture and paste it. Hmm, that's not working. Copy. Maybe you can't copy and paste files. Clipboard bidirectional. Hmm, it's not working. Well, I'll have to do a little more digging with that. Let's 
go ahead and bring up Notepad and let's see if we can copy and paste just text, okay? So I'm copying from here, pasting. Oh, so we can copy and paste text, but we may not be able to copy and paste. Let's just call it like. All right. So we can copy and paste text, but we can't copy and paste actual files. So you have to use drag and drop for files, probably but we can copy and paste text. Okay, so that's useful information. All right, if you find this video helpful, give it a like. Um, if you subscribe, I'm hoping to be adding more content that you may find interesting in the near future. Thanks for watching.